Hi people, it's Leona. Do you remember these fabulous peplum shorts from my recent book book? Well, ever since I purchased them, I've been obsessed with everything peplum. I went on a search for peplum shorts similar to this, but I wasn't able to find any where the peplum was long enough. So then I had an idea. Why don't I just make a peplum belt? One that is long enough and something I can wear with a number of outfits. So I could have went to a fabric store and purchased materials to make a belt from scratch, but ain't nobody got no time for that. So instead I opted to buy some mini skirts from ASOS.com that was on super sale. All I needed to do was to cut down the skirt and then hem it. So this is what I use to hem these skirts um, and don't worry for those of you who do not have a sewing machine, I got you, don't worry. I'm going to show you a way to hem one of the skirts without the use of a sewing machine. So first things first, turn the skirt inside out and take off all the tags. Next thing you're going to want to do is you want to determine how long or I guess how short you want the peplum belt to be. I want mine to be directly below the zipper. What I'm doing here is I'm adding an inch to that. Um, that inch is going to be a seam allowance so that when I cut, I'm not going to be cutting directly where I want the belt to end. I'm giving it some space so that I can turn the fabric up and create a hem. Here I'm bringing the fabric up about half an inch and pinning it down about every inch or so so that the fabric stays down for when I have to sew it. So right here I line the fabric up with the presser foot and I'm using that as my guide to sew along the hem of the skirt. So for those of you who do not have a sewing machine, don't fret. Um, you're going to basically do the same thing um, that you did with the other one, pinning it up and holding the fabric down so that nothing goes out of place. This sewing tape I got from the 99 cent store, so you don't have to worry about going, finding a fabric store or anything for that. And what you're going to do, you're going to line that no sew tape um, under the hem that you created and then you're going to take an iron and then you're going to press it down so that the tape melts and creates an adhesive so that the hem does not come apart. So here's the final look for both belts. Uh, let me know what you think about them. Would you be willing to actually make some for yourself? Let me know. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.